welcome to our iPhone 4 tutorials. In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to create your own ringtone using iTunes. First of all, start off by clicking on iTunes. Once you have loaded iTunes, please click inside the search bar on the top right to find your desired music track. Once found, please control click or right click to bring up a sub menu. Now click on Get Info. You will notice the track duration at the top, and at the bottom, you'll see the track file format. Anything other than M4A will require a conversion. The first thing to do is to shorten the track, because your, your iPhone 4 will only accept ringing tones up to 30 seconds long. Start off by clicking Options, and halfway down you'll see Start Time and Stop Time. Please enter the time that you wish for it to start and stop, making sure that I would recommend that you choose 29 seconds. Once complete, please click OK. Now control click or right click on your desired track, and then choose Convert to AAC version. This will now create a duplicate copy within your iTunes folder. More importantly, you'll notice that the current track is now 30 seconds long. It's probably worth going back into your original track and unclicking the start and end times to put it back to normal. Now you have your new track. Please click, drag and drop it onto your desktop just as shown. You'll notice the ending of the track or the file format is M4A. Please click inside and change that to M4R you'll see this pop up. Please click use M4R as your file format. With that selected, please click on Finder and then go and find your iTunes music folder. This is generally standard on all Mac applications. We are now within our ringtone folder. Please drag and drop your desired track into the folder, just as shown. Now jump back into iTunes, now click Ringing Tones, now click File and choose Add to Library. Navigate to your desired folder where you just copied and pasted your desired track within the iTunes Media folder. Click on your track and then click Open. This will now add the track to your list. Please now connect your iPhone 4 to your computer and begin synchronizing. If you have it on manual synchronization, you may need to change your settings as shown by clicking on iPhone, ringing tones, and ensuring that your desired track is clicked and checked. We will add some more and then click apply, and then we'll begin syncing our iPhone. Once synced, it's okay to disconnect. It's worth going back into your iTunes library and deleting the duplicate file that you've just created, just as shown. Don't worry though, this will not delete the ringing tone you've just created. Now on your iPhone 4, please touch Settings. Now select Sounds. Select Ringing Tone. If you scroll up, you'll find your desired ringing tone that you've just created under Custom. If you have any purchased ones, they'll be listed under Purchased. See, creating your iPhone ringing tone is that simple, and the great thing here is it hasn't cost you a penny to do so. We have created lots more tutorials showing you how to get the most out of your iPhone 4. Why don't you check some of those clips out now? We hope you enjoyed our tutorial. Many thanks.